Hello everybody, it's Sarge here from Sargecraft and we're finally making another Stalker playthrough series. You already seen me do Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl, which was my favorite. I made 20 some episodes of that. Now, the reasons I stopped that is because, well, I lost my big supercomputer due to bullshit that I won't go into right now. But, I have a family member that I'm using this laptop right here, which is a high-performance laptop that can run Stalker, so, which I'm thankful for that. I'm going to be making Stalker Clear Sky playthrough videos on this, which I'll make a fuck ton, I promise you. We'll get a good, we'll get a good portion of the game. And uh, after this, I'm moving on to Stalker Color Perpia and we'll call it a day. So yeah, without further ado, let's finally get started. It's been quite some time since I've played, but I still remember what to do and everything. So let's just get right into it. a legend while you were out of it. Even you wouldn't believe some of the rumors I've heard. <laughs> Anyways, here's a drink on the house for a lucky son of a gun. There then, you drink and I'll tell you about this place. I was collecting bottles one after another and they led me here. <laughs> In our base. As you can yeah. know why you've never heard of it. Because too many people want to know about it. And the fewer that do, the better. Lebedev is our leader. The man is a rock if ever I've seen one. He's the glue that holds our whole group together. Then there's Binpolev, Professor Binpolev. He's like a walking encyclopedia and a calculator in one. Knows more about the zone than, well, anyway. Our technician's called Gray, and he can make you a rifle out of an empty can with ammo to boot. He could use some spears, but uh, apart from that. And finally, we have Suslov. He's a traitor, but he ain't like the others of his trade. He won't try to rip you off or screw you. He oh, knows what stock leave the mark alone with your dirty jokes. I need that. to see him. Well, brother, if Libedev says he needs to see you, then ain't up for a discussion. Go on, I'll catch you later. Look who we got visiting our swamps. You sure are a whiff of fresh air. Welcome back from the afterworld. Yeah. I guess I can't. All right, hold on, we gotta fix something really quick. Well, all right, continuing on, sorry, I'm trying to see, I'm trying to work out the resolution and work out the game and everything, get it to run better with the graphs. I don't know if you see it, but right now it's quite lagging for me at the moment. But I'm just trying to get it to run. Right now it's running semi all right. I think I'll keep at it like it is for a little bit. I'm ah, glad to see it's you, you, young man. You look considerably better. Yes, yes. People are mistaken in their belief that they understand the essence of what the zone truly is. Some consider it to be a universal evil, others a wonder sent down to humanity, and others still consider it no more than a source of riches. They are all wrong. The z young man, if only I had the answer to that question. We are studying the zone meticulously in hopes of finding it. How can I best explain? Uh, let's put it like this. Any complicated system in nature, and that includes the zone, automatically seeks equilibrium in the absence of destabilizing external factors. That was the case, and that's okay. what we are attempting to find out. Perhaps knowing who disrupted the zone's equilibrium will give us a chance to prevent a disaster. Since man caused this mess in the first place, man may well be the only one able to set it right. In any event, I very much hope that is the I fear that question is not one I can answer. Hopefully, my answers will be of help to us all. Yep, yep, whatever. 
Uh, I have played this game before, I know it is. It's never recorded this game before. Ah, uh, yes. Got some fresh air? You look better, that's for sure. Let me fill you in on this situation. As I said, no, that emission was incredibly pop- I see. How getting out of here isn't easy, not by a long shot. We are having a very tough time here recently. The emission reduced the number of anomalies in the swamps, which made the area easily accessible for bandits and other- This is the second outpost! We're under attack! I repeat, we're under attack! Help! That's enough chit-chat. There's been another attack on our outgrade. Get over to the trader and- Yep, yep, yep. I think it'll run better when I get out of the, uh... Roger that. I forgot how to run. Hello there. At last. Here, take this basic equipment kit. It's designed... I've been ordered to issue you some equipment. There's no time for quest. Okay. I do have to cut this off in between loading because it will freeze. I've learned this from the last uh, stalker playthrough I did with Shadow Chernobyl. So I'll see you guys on the other side.